Hey, what's up, guys? It's Jayzy here, and you are watching my Left 4 Dead 2 expert walkthrough. The level is Hotel, and the campaign is Dead Center. So, little uh, side note, guys. My channel is officially a sub for sub channel, and that means if you subscribe to my channel, send me a friend request, and then send me a personal message saying that you did that. I will 100% subscribe to your channel, no ifs, ands, or buts. So, if you're interested in that, please go uh, try it out. If you already subscribed to my channel, just send me a friend request and then a personal message because I can't go around <coughs> finding these things. <coughs> Excuse me. I can't go around finding these things because uh, I don't know a method on doing it, and plus, I think it'd be time consuming if I did on the the way that, I, that I'm thinking. <laughs> so, my fans, uh, they wanted me to do an expert walkthrough, so here it is. Plain and simple. Um, I will... I finished the entire game on expert. Um, let's see. I think, it, I think I started it on Friday and now it's Sunday morning and I just finished up the last campaign with a few friends well actually not friends we became friends they were all randoms because I woke up really early and then I just started a public match and three people came and we finished it and that was it so finished the campaign all the campaigns from Friday till Sunday morning and now I all the rest of Sunday I'm going to be making the commentaries for every the entire campaign so I can get it off my hard drive uh, because I only have a 300 gig um, and uh, what was I going to say I only have a 300 gig so I have, I have to go and erase all of it because it's like over a hundred gigs of <coughs> recording stuff and I, I need to, I need room for uh, Modern Warfare 2 videos and stuff like that, my Mass Effect 2 videos that I need to tie up. I think I'm going to finish it up tonight. I think I'm going to finish my Mass Effect tonight. So look forward to that if you're into my Mass Effect 2 walkthroughs. Um, let's see. So yeah, little, little uh, techniques that you can learn on this is uh, always stick with your team no matter what if you you know get away from your team then you have a high probability of getting owned and that's you know that's that's never healthy wait a second I need to take my microphone off my head because I need to go grab my green tea there we go um always check when I'm uh, doing this commentary for you guys always check every single corner because every single corner is gonna allow you to um, find new items and as you can see here you get down very quickly very quickly and you know every single item helps so always try and find as many of them as possible. <laughs> never never let go of things either. If you find something and you don't really need it, like say a, a med pack, use it. Grab the new med pack because you're never going to go back, right? Except on certain campaigns like uh, like Hard Rain, you go backwards and it's retarded. But let's forget Hard Rain for a little bit. <laughs> and especially when you're doing it on Expert, it uh, it saves the data, especially from this new patch. I don't know if I did it before, but uh, it saves the data. So, like, say on hard rain, you uh, take all the stuff from the one spawn room, and you go back to it on the second last level or the last level. If you used everything in there, then there's going to be nothing left, and you don't get anything extra. And if you're going for the achievement, then you need to do the entire campaign in one hit. Now, I didn't do every single campaign in one hit each. I think I got like three of the achievements out of 
out of five. So that means like three of the campaigns I did straight and the other two I didn't. I'm not too sure though, but I have done all five campaigns straight when I first got the game. Well, when I first got the game, I wasn't recording. I recorded about a month after. So, and also my achievements got reset because on Steam, Steam's messed up. <laughs> They've been actually been reset twice. Just shenanigans, but whatever. Just shenanigans. What can you do? Um. Yeah. Let's see. I take the shotgun because the shotgun. It allows you to step up to a target and pull the trigger and not worry about them getting up. When an Uzi, you can run up to them point blank and shoot like five rounds at them, it wouldn't make a difference. Here I threw the grenade into the fire because not only will you get the zombies into the fire, they'll also blow up, which is a good thing. So it's like a two in one, it's kind of like a it's kind of like the same deal as like a bile and a Molotov mixture. So here, I take the, uh, the adrenaline and rush ahead and that's it. Simple as that guys. Um, a little side note guys, I have a PayPal account and if any of you want to donate, whether it be 50 cents or a dollar, Everything will be greatly appreciated and all go towards gaming supplies because they can get quite expensive. Anyways, guys, if you can do that, please thank you. Rate, comment, subscribe. See you later.